What's good people, myself Nede and this is the official lyric breakdown of my new single, Jet Lag. Chorus, took so many flights in my life, still feel like I've got jet lag. Could have been this and it could have been that, but I couldn't be stuck or set back. Took so many flights in my life, I might invest in a jetpack. Could have been this and I could have been that, still step too smooth so I'll get back. So, after travelling to thankfully 35 countries uh, in my life to this point, which I'm very, very happy and blessed to do. Um, it gets to a point where you either have travel blues, and I think I was working really hard at the end of last year, kind of prepping for this year and whatever. And it got to a point where it was almost like a consistent feeling of jet lag, like when you, you're tired and you're lethargic. And there's not really a cure besides rest, but when you're resting, you're restless, because it's hard to rest. It's one big cycle. Um, and then I remember when I stepped into the studio, I was very tired and it was the most tired I've been in a while. When this, the production of this, I just started moving. It was very basic at this point. I only had like the um, the kick drum and I think the 808s in and then the synth sound, um, but that kind of built it. And then that spawned the first um, bar and then that spawned the rest of the chorus. Could have been this, could have been that, but I couldn't be stuck or set back. Um, could have gone down many different paths in life to date so far. Um, thankfully, I'm still here. Um, rest in peace to Amanda, etc, etc. But could have been this, could have been that, stuck or setback means I can be anything and I can do and achieve anything as long as I am not stuck or setback. And the only thing that I can do that is myself. Like if I get into my own head or if I say, oh, this is the, like, this is the pinnacle. I can't produce a better piece of this than that or whatever. Like I'm the only person I have to beat every day. As long as I can beat myself every day, I'm nice. You get me? Jetpack is literally when I have the money and when jetpacks are a casual thing, same way when Pokemon are a casual thing and you see them out on the street, yeah? We're all gonna have jetpacks. So that, I'm just gassed to get a jetpack, you get me? And then Step Too Smooth, also on the same, no, the second time I went to the studio to carry on with a tune, I had fresh crepes, I had a fresh trim. I think I had a new tracksuit, but my tracksuit had just been washed. And I was like, if it's snuggy, I was like, yeah, I'm looking hench today. I'm feeling good today, you get me? And that's just the whole chorus. It's just like a feel good. It's like an amalgamation of things, but just feeling good. Verse one, first class ticket, push to the limit, counting digits, moving wicked, top spot, pivot, counting hours, not minutes. This one short like snippet, two step off the mark, see who's quickest. You be me, you lose and I'm winning. Left in the dust and I've been there to finish. Very braggadocious kind of, yeah, I'm the best. And I, again, it was going back to the feeling myself and I was like, yeah, right now, I'm on form, I'm feeling good. First class ticket is like, I want to fly first class, but my bank account, doesn't want me to fly first class. You hear me? So that's kind of the, like the dilemma I'm in. Um, and then that's kind of that whole first eight bar of that verse. And that's what that was about really. Can't keep up with the levels, man said. Don't care who's heavy, who's next. Might have been taking your rock next. On the one line, heading your mess, pure energy life in the flesh. Counting cash and chasing check. Sounding brush and raving flip. Walk through duty free in the airport and swipe the Amex. So don't care who's next in the sense of what I was referring to earlier. Like I'm just competing with myself. You've got your journey, you've got your journey. And if I focus on theirs or take notice of theirs, then I've lost sight of my own journey. So it's good to show appreciation and you can see what other people are doing and take and learn from them. But it's like, I know what I want to do. I've got my entire plan for whatever I've written down. And it's just a case of reverse engineering it and then execution of that plan is crucial. And then energy live in the flesh. I miss performing. Every single person on the planet right now, we miss performing live. However, when it comes back, get yourself down to a Mayday show because the energy is on real and i've got songs like whoosh i've got songs like jet lag like everything in the catalog that i haven't performed yet that i'm ready to perform you're gonna want to be there so make sure you get down walk through duty free in the airport and swipe the amex so with credit cards and with finance in general investing etc etc i've got a bit better at it and i've studied it a bit more so i actually got a credit card and for obvious reasons if you have one you understand obviously it can be a massive detriment but basically i got a credit card so next time i'm in duty free jay wants a bagel BC wants to drink, just Amex in it and then just pay it off later. I don't agree with the buy now, pay later, but with credit card, can go in handy. And I got a massive like 10,000 bonus points for the sign up or whatever. So like my next flight is free, <laughs> makes sense to me. I've been tired since I was born, work all night to the early morn. Bags on IG, you see I'm worn, up in dark, bed at dawn. Sometime talk, more time yawn, work for the life I want and drawn. Can't forget who I am, if I do, then I gotta find out like Jason Bourne. So tired since I was born. Like my mom, my mom says it's like oh, I've been tired since I was born. Or someone said it like, oh, I've been tired since I was born. It's just when you feel it really, like you feel the weight of whatever you got going on, or work, something, or whatever. And it's just one of them. Like 
I remember I got to the point where I worked so hard and everyone was like rest. I was like, nah, nah, I won't burn out. And I didn't burn out, but I definitely understood the power of resting and how he can make me work harder because I'm more well rested. Such a simple concept. But at least for me at that time, it was definitely, I overlooked it, almost ignored it to an extent. I was just like, get up, complete the mission, get the results, return to the safe house. That was the whole plan. Um, and then off the back of that, like I've got an idea of what I want to achieve. So the life I want, I've worked and drawn, but I can't forget who I am. Jason Bourne is basically, I know what I've got to do, but if I lose myself in the process, whether I change or whatever else, it's not going to be conclusive to the process. Um, so it's really something I'm very mindful of, but trying to keep to who I am, keep myself in check, et cetera, et cetera, and just do what I need to do. Um, and then Jason Bourne, obviously, lose his mind, et cetera, et cetera. If you've seen the film, cool, you understand what that's about. And that's verse one. Verse two, smile on my face and I woke up feeling blessed. Same gold chain on my chest. Bedroom come like a hotel when I get out and dress cause I am number one guest. Who would have actually guessed? Feeling the best, not feeling the stress. Got no time to rest or complete the quest. So since Christmas 2014, this gold chain, yeah, my mom bought, I always wanted a gold chain for the longest time. I wanted them fat Cuban looks. Obviously, dead piece. I think this is like 108 at the time, which was a lot, and it was my only Christmas present that year. And I was just satisfied. I was like, yeah, this is what I want. Like it was something, it was one of the last things I really remember wanting, like really remember wanting. Um, so thanks mom, I appreciate it. Don't think I've taken it off, whether it's a basketball or in the shower, wore it every single day. You know when you have fresh sheets on your bed, and you're like, yeah, I feel like you just work in a hotel, and you just clean, same day, same day, I just had fresh sheets and I was feeling it. Um, now I think I was feeling myself like I knew I was looking good that day for like a various reasons. So I was like, yeah, I woke up feeling good. Number one guest, top of the bill, superstar, me. Yeah, I mean, so that's what that was. And then go back to verse one, the whole thing about wrestling, etc., etc. Feeling the best, no time to stress. Rest, complete the quest. Again, complete the quest and get the results. Yes, but being well rested, hydrated, etc., etc., helps me get there faster. Used to get paid in bits and coin, and now I get paid in Bitcoin. You've seen the price of Bitcoin recently, or if you know about Bitcoin, that line explains itself simply. Can't try to leave the team and then come back round and then try to rejoin. Never not got one goal or task done and then captured the checkpoint. Know what I want and need to do, I'm accurate down to the pinpoint. So basically, if I'm involved in something and I've got a job, a role, things I need to do, I will get them done to the best of my ability as accurate as possible. Perfectionism is a thing but aim for perfection and nothing would ever get done. So as long as I can do it to the best of my ability and I put 110% in, I'm happy with that. And that's the whole song. So Mayday, Jetlag, produced by Dubsco, is out everywhere right now. Music video, streaming platforms, it's everywhere. So don't forget to subscribe as well.